This is KRQE News 13 with Dick Niffing and Jessica Gatate. A group of New Mexico kids who have had more than their share of grief are finally having some fun. Today, 10 children who have lost a parent in either Iraq or Afghanistan boarded a flight to Dallas as part of the Snowball Express. Here's News 13's Amanda Goodman. Well, after a going away party, the group took off from the Sunport on an all expense paid journey that will hopefully bring some much needed holiday cheer. Emotions here run the gamut from anticipation to pure delight. And for perhaps the first time in a long time, these kids have something to smile about. Debbie Kofeld's husband was killed in Iraq. I have five children. And this is something that, you know, all of them are excited. And I've got ages from 9 to 17. Debbie and her kids are setting off for four days of fun. The goal of this program is to let these kids get their minds off the losses they've suffered back at home and just be kids. There's been so much sorrow to have smiles put on your children's faces when they don't smile as often as they used to. is something that can never be repaid. To the families of our fallen heroes, to the kids, uh, we honor you. Uh, they will not be forgotten. Debbie says trips like this are a surefire way to make sure her kids remember their father and the sacrifice he made. And it helps keep our husband's memories alive and their dad's memories alive. While making new memories that will help them heal. Debbie says this time of year is always bittersweet for her family because Christmas was actually the last time they ever saw their dad. Jessica, back to you. Okay, Amanda, all together, 1,300 children and surviving spouses from all over the U.S. will gather in Dallas. The Snowball Express is a national charity. It started providing these trips in 2006.